YouTube. It's your boy Fishing King Hook City TV. I got my main man with me. Hook City. It's about to go down. Y'all know what time it is, man. If y'all ain't got that intro memorized by now, I don't know what to tell you, man. Welcome back to another video, man. I decided to challenge myself today, man. Me and Dad have wrestled with what we should do, where we should go. Dad, have you ever fished this lake? Yeah, I've been to it a couple of times. What can you tell me about it without giving me the name of the lake? Uh, it's a lake that holds uh, quite a number of alligators in it. Yes, sir. It's, I've been told. It's part of Tarrant County. And uh, we're going to see what we can do with it. We're going to see what we can do with it, man. Um, I've been to the lake a handful of times, man. Uh, I've did some dock shooting on this lake. I know it has black and white crappie. Um, and alligators. It's an old lake, so I expect for it to be some big fish. At least, you know, a good population of fish, man. I'm, I'm hoping for, for many thumps. Now, y'all know we don't trophy fish, we grocery fish. But today, I, I am looking for some bigger specimens, hopefully. I would like to catch a few donkeys, man. Y'all know, listen, I love to do the hee-haw, man. I love to do the hee-haw for y'all. And uh, man, it ain't nothing like sticking a big pig, man. I know we're gonna be using some brush pile jigs today. When I get down there, we're gonna look at the water clarity. Um, if the water is muddy, we're probably gonna use dark colors with like a, a bright uh, jig head. Um, if the water is more clear, then we're gonna start kind of getting out of that bright stuff into the more natural looking stuff if the visibility is real good. We've had a lot of rain in recent days, man, so I'm expecting the water to be a little more murky um, I'm expecting the fish maybe what? I don't know, eight to 15, eight to 20. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm keeping it real broad because we really don't know. You know, like I said, I haven't been on this lake in a year. Last time I was here, I didn't record. Uh, me and my buddy Mandel, AKA Swample, we went down there, man, and, and got on these fish and got on some good ones. But now we're in the spawn, pre spawn, um, and hopefully we can catch some more good ones with big bellies. Y'all stay tuned, man. When y'all see me again, we'll be back on the water. Just like that, I told y'all guys, when we got to the water, you were gonna see me again. We're in the lake, man, boat cranked up good. We made it, I got my dad with me, my family is good, my wife is at work, my daughter's at school, my mama's chilling at the house. I can thank Jesus, man, because we got to see another day. Let's go put a fish in the boat. All right, guys, listen, this is some light stained water. I can tell it's a little clearer than that. Um, last trip out, I had black and chartreuse on. We're gonna keep black and chartreuse on, man. That, listen, it's, it's a staple, it's a color that that is, man, listen, it's second to none, but we're gonna use black and chartreuse. Got a black ACC crappie sticks head on that thing. Um, pegged, I got it a little low. We're gonna go about a foot above that weight, guy. I mean, above, my jig, we have a 1 8 ounce weight. It's a little windy out here. Hopefully the audio is going to be all right today. We're going to find out what we can do, man. You ready to go? Yeah, we ready. Bunch of fish on the bottom, but I'm not sold. Those are crappie. But they, and they all moving. Man, that, them crappie, they spooky, but they ain't going to be that spooky. You got to stay on that ridge line. That might be a crappie, 40 foot. See how he's sitting there? I think that might be what we're looking for. If he's gonna stay there is the question. Yeah, that's a good, if it's a crappie, it's a good one. But it looked like one of them, whatever that was, I threw it earlier. That's a crappie. Big one. I'm telling you, that's a crappie. That's a crappie, a good one too. First fish on y'all. First, oh man, that, that's a white crappie. Big white crappie. Woo! All right, y'all, first fish of the day. Oh my goodness, seven foot of water. Daddy, look at the size. Woo. First fish of the day, guys. We've been trolling a grass line no, I got in the gills. Man, that fish is bleeding. We hit it in the gills. 
but trolling the grass line with that black and chartreuse using our live scope to see what we can find that was our first fish man i like the way that's looking get her in the live well so she won't bleed all over my boat we're gonna keep rocking that looks just like a fish sitting on the bottom that's a little ball sitting on the bottom Got me. I don't know what they are. Well, we ain't gonna make them be nothing but what they is. I know how to look for another suspense now. I got a dog now. That's not a crappie. That's a fish sitting on top of something. Come on. Yeah. I actually stay there. Here he come. Here he come. Fish number two, man. Come on, get him up here, daddy. Get him up here. Cause I don't think your hook is in him. It's your fast snap. Your fast snap caught that fish. And I got a hee <laughs> Man, I'm telling you, the first two fish at this lake, I ain't mad at. Mm -mm. This is what you're looking for. Pregnant females, man. Mm -hmm. Ooh-wee. We don't trophy fish. What you do? We grocery fish. Y'all see it. Let's go, baby. Look at him going in the cooler. <laughs> in the cooler. Got two piece. Extra crispy. I feel like we in carp heaven. I mean, it's clearly some crappie in here, but you gotta, you gotta really train your eye today. He just nipped it, just a nip. Male, that's a male crappie. And the way I can tell is because he trying to get hormonal. He's out here in 12 foot of water, but you can see those little blotches starting to come in and his anal fins are black. Pectoral fins are trying to get black around the tips. That's a fish that hadn't moved up yet. Um, that's definitely a male crappie, man. Third crappie, we moved out to 12 foot. Y'all see what we found. We're gonna keep moving. I'm gonna have to get out the middle of the lake. Like rock bluffs, stuff like that. Might be holding some fish, waiting to pull up on them rocks. You know what I mean? You wanna go in that first one on the left? You can see it on the map. See right there on the map? All right, guys, we aborted that first mission, man. The reason why we chose that spot um, is because it had a bunch of grass, a bunch of weeds. Um, and the reason I'm at this lake is because of my buddy Chris. So shout out to Chris, man. We appreciate you um, for just getting our minds on. Let's go out here and see what we can do. Um, so now, uh, this time of year, man, look, if these fish aren't on the banks, they're staging, and that's what we've been dealing with. So we're actually in a cove or about to go into a cove but i stopped short of being inside the cove so i could check the mouth of it we're in 13 foot of water right now rocky shoreline um and it doesn't go really deep off into this cove man but we're gonna check it out sweep around see what we can find y'all stay tuned crop it made a drop on a fish let's see what he want to be Had to drop on the fish and he ain't had no kind of, no kind of want to. Came right to it and didn't want to do it. Look at her, man. Now I know I went over that fish head. He ain't feeling it. But he already moved. Uh -uh, he, uh -uh, don't get over here by me. Don't come over here. Yeah, 
Yeah. He coming. A little bit of crappie. I figured that's what it was going to be. Little old bitty. I don't even know why she in here by herself. Him. Might be a male. Mean as a bull. In here by itself. And you ain't gonna find no girlfriend in here, homeboy. You in there by yourself. You're lonesome. In there by your lonesome. Mm. You better get on back down there. Mr. Cumberan come see you. Up off of this tree. Because there's fish in there. You got one following you. Baby, baby, baby. That's a little male. Look like a, yeah. See, he got the same little thing going where his, where his uh, fins are starting to get dark. Yeah. See, those fish ain't ready to go yet, though, man. If he was ready to go, he'd be dark. You know what I mean? Yeah. That fish ain't ready to go. He bit, though. Yeah, he bit. And he in the back of this cove. So, listen, the idea wasn't bad. It's just not time yet, man. One thing we don't do is rush these crappie. If they're not here, they, if they're not ready to go, they're just not ready to go. That's a fish on that tree, 20 foot out. Mm -hmm. I think that's a fish. You gonna hit him. You <laughs> pull it, pull it, just pull it. Just pull it, you gonna lose it. This ain't no well, listen, is you gonna catch it? Yeah. Both flip. Come on, both flip. That's a two pounder. <laughs> <laughs> I think you got you a deuce there, house. Yeah, that's a I think you got you a deuce there, house. If he ain't, she ain't a deuce. She real close. Yeah. God told Marty. God told Marty. What'd you say? Man, you done dropped down and got a halt or something. Hold on, what's that? That black and short Black tube. and what's short too. Gonna use it, man. Make him cut loose. Listen, I knew you could both flip because I knew what Roger had in your hand. That ACC crappie stick. Yes, both flip them, flip them every time. Yeah, look at that. It's a nice fish, man. Ooh yes, sir. Do we want to wait on? He might, man, look at the mouth on that. He piece. could be too. I mean, all I'm hearing is hee haw. I believe it is. I believe it's a, ah, it's, it's a two pound crappie, man. You think so? Mm -hmm. I think it's gonna be just under. I'm thinking it's gonna be nah, about a 175, 180. He's two. short. Let's let's find out, y'all. It's two pound. All right, y'all. We zeroed out. Let him go. Told you. One seven. I think I'm looking at. Man, it's hard to see. One eighty. One eighty. Got a one eighty, guys. Good fish, y'all. Female. Listen, we're gonna figure something out, man. I don't, I don't know much about this lake, but I know a lot about cropping. We're gonna get them figured out. Let's keep working. Okay. Man, there's plenty of little fingers to explore, especially that one. How long that thing is? All right, guys. Spot number three is real similar. We just went around the corner into a actually into an arm and this arm has some little coves in it um as soon as i put the trolling motor down man i saw one let's see how he gonna act here it come Ooh. behind the back pass okay, not a big fish not a big fish i mean dad hadn't even came up here yet it looked a whole lot bigger on the screen, I tell you that. But this is, listen, it is a small fish, but I can tell you this is another male that has not pushed up yet. This right here would keep me from uh, casting on the banks, man. I don't like doing it too much, no way. Um, there probably are some there, but there are still fish, even males that are out here staging on the outside. This one gets to go back, gotta be 10 in Texas. Man, I couldn't even put the camera on quick enough, y'all. I literally let that fish go, scanned, and saw another fish. We're in 10 foot of water. That one was about four foot down, and I just kind of pitched out. I wasn't thinking about the camera much, so y'all forgive me for that. Same thing. <sighs> come on. Same thing. That one got to come with us. Showing a little bit more color, though, Dad. It's a male. Showing, it's showing, it, showing a little bit more color. Look at that anal fin. Beautiful. Fish. Yeah, man. He going to get dark in the live well. How much you want to bet? He will. 
He gonna get darker. We're gonna find out too. Beautiful, beautiful. We're gonna find out. Put him in there with the ladies. So we got a mess going on right now. Y'all don't look at that. Get in there, boy. Hey, going. What's going on? Go. Go. Okay. Man, you gotta be kidding me, guys. I promise I'm not trying to do y'all like this. I literally put my pole down because it was Dad's turn. I panned that way. There was a fish sitting on the bottom. All I had to do was drop my rod tip and she came and nailed it. My God. Uh, I hit another one. No, it's not quite a hee haw, but it's one for the pot. We're gonna fry him up crispy and good. Crispy and good. Yes, sir. Uh, Hook City TV. Come get you some. Come get you some. You said, listen. ACC Cropper Sticker, get it done. Yes, sir. Let's go. We Let's on go, the hook. Move, Mike. Let's go. Fry it up under that. There's fish in there. I just. There you go. That's Yo. a cat. Hold on to him. That's catfish. Mm. That's catfish. Oh, what that is? It ain't a crappie. No. Uh -huh. And up. Bluesky. Yeah, you want to get him in the net? No, nah, just bring him this way. Oh, Bluesky. You want that Bluesky? I'm going to eat him, maybe. <laughs> I'm going to eat him. What you, what you, what you talking about, Daddy? I don't know what he's talking about, but I see grits. Grits? Yeah, fish and grits. Fish and grits. Yes, sir. Nice kind of cat. It looks good now. Yeah, he gonna taste good too. You think so? Cornmeal. <laughs> he gonna make a model. Cornmeal model. Get you some. Get you some. Man, we're gonna get this old nasty thing off the hook. We're gonna get right back in it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God oh, almighty, daddy. Man, man. I wouldn't even play with that fish. No, I'm fin that one finna get caught. No. She don't run off. Not really. <laughs> I ain't gonna know. <laughs> nah, I wanted that fish now, daddy. I ain't, don't, don't let me lie to you. Man, that fish ain't, I'm t man, that fish is just tapping on this jig. You got the same color on, don't you? Yeah. That ain't gonna work, then. Going, man. That him moving off? Yeah, Daddy, I'm telling you, that fish didn't bite that jig, man. Oh, Lord, he didn't bite it. He's just nipping at it. Here he come again. Yeah, you listen, you can't do me like that too many times, baby. Yeah. You come on up here and talk to me. Nipple, little nipple. Yes, Nipsey Hustle. <laughs> but that's the end. That's the end of coming. You gotta worry about, gotta, gotta worry about no back and forth. I ain't going back and forth with you. I ain't going back and forth. We just going back in the live wheel. Yes, sir. Let's go, baby.